guy. What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? We're trying to defeat these racer punks. In the demo scrapyard. it for you. Oh, that's Sarah. Or Andresia. Andresia is here. Sheesh, goodbye. Reloading. Reloading again. No, I've been set ablaze. Give me some cover. Damn it. I've been set ablaze again. This is bad. We got them, Andresia. Oh, there's supposedly one more this way. According to our watch. Oh, he's lighting me up. What are you doing right here? One shot, that's all it takes. That's right. Alright, now we got them all. on my watch this year. I've got a lot of illnesses and injuries. I'm not the greatest at taking care of my character's health. Let's go to the cockpit. I think we might have to go back to the civilian settlement now. Let's see. Let's see here. Let's go back to the star map. Spaceship has been killed under the threat. I should let the colonists know. So yeah, I'm gonna have to go back there. Base and then Hello, land. Captain. So we're gonna have to go to the cockpit, take off, and then select the planet so we can land. I need it. Don't let that travel dead. Take us to our ship. 
which is where we already were. Achieving orbit now. I think it would be a lot more fun if we could fly the ship, you know, just manually fly the ship to the next base. Every world with living things is a treasure. Rather than just a cutscene. Or not even a cutscene, a loading screen. I jumped in the lava yesterday. I'm gonna resist the urge. Today. I can do it. Just gotta stay. Don't try to go off. Thanks again. Why don't Sometimes I wonder, wonder what life would be like if I never moved to explain to Vanguard as much as me. They're all saying something at the same time. I didn't understand any of it. Oh, you're back. I hope <laughs> this means you have good news. The spacers have been dealt Thanks with. Thanks for coming through for us. Here, this is for you. I only wish I had more to give. Safe Secure travels, my lung friend. damage. All right. And gave me 3,000 credits. Awesome. Folks like you don't usually make it out this far. I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. Then why are you talking to one? You know what? What are you oh, going to wow. say? Oh, wow. A real adventurer. I came here. Mom says she'll take me for a ride on the ship when I get a little older. I hated it back then. Now it feels like home. What up, Colin? Nice to meet you. We don't see a lot of new faces. I've been here from the beginning. Outposts from come the a long beginning. Way since he's then. been here. My mom helped build our outpost. Isn't that cool? Please watch your step. It is imperative that you do not disturb the soil. Wise words. You should check out our store while you're here. Our vendor could use the business. Someday, I'm going to be the toughest pirate in the whole galaxy. Shit, he wants to be a pirate? Uh-oh. I guess we'll continue our journey into the unknown. So for this character, this is the first female character I made. Her name is Jupiter, and I made her resemble Andresia, so she's like a sister to Andresia, and a beast hunter. So claimed the lives of many beasts she has. Our ship. That's not it. Do you see anything useful? There's our ship. Fast travel to the ship. Continue the voyage elsewhere. This is quite the loading screen. Goodness gracious.
starting to think the game is frozen. But you, the loading circle would stop if it was broken, right? Right? The ring is still going. Oh, no. Well, the recording is working right now, so we're not going to stop the recording. You're going to get to witness what happens when the game doesn't work. What we do is we push the X button in the middle, and then we quit the game. And then we push the game again. Push A on the game again. And now we load up the star field and see where it loads us up at. Because you never know where we're going to start back up again when the game finishes loading in. I guess we could actually load up a different character. Uh, I remember how. Shit. Jemison. Yeah, I don't know. I have to just continue with Jupiter. I don't know what any of those saves are. I thought I was just gonna select between my other characters. Uh-oh. Maybe this is my only one now. And we're back. And now I have to go return to the colonists again. That's where it spit me out at. So we're going to take off. We have to land. We have to listen to the colonists again. Hello. Oh, man. I right, Take off. Civilian outpost. Again. Hydrocarbons in abundance. Let us see how they have arranged themselves. Welcome back. So, Spaces that's won't great. Be giving news. You any trouble. Thanks for getting Again. this done. Please take this. Thanks for the credit. Oh, but you didn't cure my lungs this time. Oh, no. Ship. 
We're walking back to the ship. We're not even going to try to pass through. Thick clouds of dust blowing around. <laughs> We're almost there. We're gonna slow down now. My lung disease is getting to me. Walked over a gas vent. There we go, we made it to the ship. But we've got friends. I'm hurting lock dog razors. Luckily, they ran away. Nicola first, so we're gonna go to Nicola next. In our class A ship. It is big for a class A. Still just a class A. of helium-3. Nicola-2. Deep freeze. Nicola-2. Deserted robotics lab on Nicola-2. Let's go check it out. Hello. Here. There you are. I am not so rare that the someone mysterious new comes captain. along. Free star collective symbol. Is that your ship? Trident ships are incredibly oh, expensive. Something? I suppose it did cost a few fortunes. But it is nice to travel with a modicum of style. I'd appreciate it if you'd explain yourself. 
No, who are you? What are you it's talking? not yet time. I don't even know if it will ever be. But hope and my pocketbook springs eternal. I really can't say. As much, it may mean nothing, but I'm rooting for you. Rooting for Sorry. what? Terribly mysterious. Please, just be careful. I hope to see you at a much <laughs> My lung disease is getting to me. I have to go. Oh, you have to go. Damn. Deserted robotics labs this way. Land there. We're in the Nicola system. Set him down. Everything in the green. Nicola. Exit the ship. And another loading screen. That we may not ever get past. You can do it. Come on, I believe in you. Come on, video game. What are you doing? What are you doing to me? Oh, man. Well, ladies and gentlemen. I guess we'll give it one more go. We'll give it one more try today. Last chance. It's the last chance for Starfield. Continuing on Jupiter. you again we just talked to you but unfortunately the game forgot <laughs> this time we're able to land after the second full game restart in 20 minutes no organics here Valuable minerals, perhaps. It's 
unlock this case. Just a riveter. I don't want any rivets. Wicked lame. What am I going to do with a riveter? Get out of the way. There's people up there. I have to go say hello. Take this stuff. Oh, well, pirate now. Two hazmats. <laughs> exploring. Terminal on the catwalk. Worth investigating, if heights do not bother you. What did she say? Something about the catwalk. Cred sticks, helmet display. Shock troop space helmet. Sure, I'll take it. Oh, the lock's too difficult. I can't do that. There we go. And we can get ourselves a calibrated regular. Oh, we could lame. 
Guess we can always take ammo. Let's see if what's on this computer on a random planet that's uh, in a base occupied by pirates. Let's update friend or foe settings. Remove combat inhibitors. Okay. Now. Oh. I'll just activate, I guess. I just made them all come after me. Attacking the pirate. Who knows? Enough of this place. Let this be. Nothing happened. Off we go. Captain, it is pleasant to see you. There's Jupiter. Got like tribal tattoos all over. Quick tour of the ship since we're just chilling in orbit right now. It's a very long ship. Any new orders for me? Yes. <laughs> My lung disease. It hurts. Yeah, what is it? What are you doing, Sarah? What up? Let's see what's up now with Sarah. Now that we Sarah. have a moment, I wanted to ask how you're feeling. I wanted to ask how you're feeling. After your experience at the temple, you've given everyone at the lodge quite a scare. I feel confused, like I don't understand what has happened to me. Mm -hmm. That's a very reasonable answer. According to what I've heard, your body absorbed an almost unquantifiable amount of energy of a type we can't even begin to understand. Man, no wonder I'm We're so We're dealing unhealthy. with something unknown to modern science. Who knows how this encounter has affected your body or your mind? Hmm. 
Hmm. Take me I know you're simply trying human. to brush this off with humor, but you really should act more concerned. That temple proves we're dealing with entities of unknown origin. The problem is that we can't even begin to guess what their intention was towards us and where they've gone. Perhaps that's true, oh, my lung or damage perhaps is you were simply better. quite lucky. It's just that... Oh, I'm afraid that we're flying almost completely blind here. All we know for certain at this point is that whoever created the artifacts are the same beings that built the temple. Anything else is just guesswork. I might as well put on a blindfold and toss darts at theories written on the wall. I think you're taking all of this too seriously. Well, what did you expect? This discovery is off the scale. Think about the significance of this research. The questions it raises alone the are mind-boggling. Who was this wondrous structure built to accommodate? How long ago did these entities inhabit our universe? <coughs> are they still out there? Somewhere. Perhaps. We'll need more data to be sure. It's funny. I used to think the artifacts were the end-all be-all of scientific discovery. The pinnacle mystery of our time. Never in my wildest dreams did I imagine it would lead to something of this magnitude. I just hope that you'll come through this. Whatever it is. Unharmed. I could flirt with her. And here I thought I was the subject of your wildest dreams. We'll be we'll be cordial. And here I thought I was Constellation's new oh, lab of rat. Of course you aren't. My number one priority is the safe. Look, I've already taken up. All I can do is promise. Whatever. This is taking too long. Oh, there we go. Just wanted to give the tour of the ship. Anyway, there's the back mirror. Or window. And then up here. If Andresia will get out of our way now. There's the other back window the other top floor. I don't have anything in there. Looks like it's just another living area, pretty much. Take the vial. Pick up the bottle. Maybe I can brew something up for me in the pharmaceutical lab. Some antibiotics. Treat afflictions. Treats infections. I don't have any infections. Bandages, immobilizers. Provide rigid support to injured limbs. Heal pace. Injector penicillin. Sicknesses, though. What is my sickness? Oh, I just have a cough now. I'm doing good. I think I saw one. I think I a little cough. This one. Of the injector. It's a metabolic agent. Snake oil. Make some here. Oops, I didn't want to take Pharmacology. I get to give a free one. Yeah, I'm post engineer.
cockpit. Cockpit we go. Well, more like a bridge, rather. Step onto the bridge. Schrodinger, so we're gonna have to go to Leviathan first. Power of the grab drive, let's go. Navigational feedback checks out. We're in the right place. in the star system. She is. Shooting the three. On to the next star system. Jump complete. Propulsion restored. We've arrived at Schrodinger, and it looks like. But it is something massive and dead. Oh, 
them. But I don't recall. Definitely don't remember. I got a dead body. It's not looking good. Hello. Got credits. I'll take them. There's a pack. Autopsy report. Cause of death. A series of puncture wounds. Or apparent blunt force trauma to the head, neck, torso. Suspected causes of death are either a series of puncture wounds or apparent blunt force trauma to the head, neck, torso, and extremities. Sounds like that body was in rough shape, Alex T. Sarah P's causes of death are the same. A series of puncture wounds or apparent blood force trauma to everything. Life support. Can't connect to the life support system. Ship lockdown. Attention all crew, the ship is in lockdown. For an undetermined period of time, please remain in quarters. Well, damn. No signs of life. Ship's on lockdown. Puncture wounds. Severe wounds to every part of the bodies that are deceased. This is, uh, creepy. Out in the star system, Schrodinger, this is the first thing we encounter. Personal digiframe. Got the life support though. Live crew vitals. Everyone's dead. Yo. No one's alive. Broadcasting SOS. Can't connect to the mainframe.
dead. I'll take them credits. Empty chunks, oh man. Someone's leaving their empty chunks around. Go down farther. I guess we'll just keep going. Another mainframe. Ship status, everything's disconnected. Remote security door control. Open the doors. Open all the doors. Shit going on in there. I don't think we can get back there. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. Let me go ahead and get out of here now. This has been one hour of really kind of every reason why I don't play it anymore, but also the reasons I keep coming back. You never know what you're gonna find, but also you never know how many times the game is gonna crash. stopping by. Nice. Don't forget to subscribe.